how's everyone today? Hope everyone's well. It's super hot in the UK. It's so hot in fact that I have this little spray bottle and every now and again, I have to spray myself like a diva. <laughs> anyway, I digress. 10 performances that prove that Ariana Grande is one of the best singers ever. This video is by Pleasant Ariana and I haven't listened to it yet and I really want to, to see how Ariana Grande shows off her vocals. We all know she's an amazing performer live. Recently I've been really, really getting into her music. I mean, I've always been into Ariana. I have her previous albums, but this particular album, Sweetener, I think is gonna be, I think it's gonna be her best. I have a feeling because so far the songs have just been really, really good really good. When God is a Woman came out, first of all, I wasn't sure, and then after about the fourth or fifth listen, I thought, hang on a minute, this is one of the best pop songs of 2018. It is stuck in my head. It has one of those choruses that creep up on you. Do you know what I mean? Anyway, so we're gonna listen to this video, have a little watch as well, because in my previous videos, I haven't ever had the video in the video, the video on video before, and I know some of you have been asking for that, so... I wish is my command. Let's listen to this video. So this is on Jimmy Fallon. She just has such a pure tone. Like those notes. Unbelievable. And she's pitch perfect, which I love. I love hearing a singer that sounds the same on record, if not better, when they're live. I love that. Last time. good. There's such a power in her belt as well, but it's so clean. Ah, I love that lick. You got hurt in your heart. Oh. Crazy. Love this song. Those high notes. Let's find out what that note is. One second. Okay, guys. She's belting that G. That's middle C. That's the next C up. And she's doing that G above that. That is cray. Let's continue. So high. I can only dream. Can't even talk. Speechless. Has she done a live album? Because she should. I mean, it would be basically the same as on record because her voice is perfect. I love that falsetto in her voice. She has a really breathy, aspirate quality up there and it's lovely. Oh, oh, baby. Love that. It's so, these songs are so difficult to sing. You don't understand. <laughs> with that, with that sound. See, when you get up that high, it, it's quite easy to sound like you're shrieking, but she does not at all. To her, it sounds effortless when it comes out of her mouth, you know? That's special. This gonna happen. It's 
It's nice to hear her just with the guitar, you know? Side to side. I'm coming at you. Cause I know you got a bad reputation. As a man, cause you give me temptation. She can flip between her chest voice and her going into her belt and that kind of really sweet sound that she makes up top so quickly as well. Her voice floats out. It floats out of her mouth like an angel. See, she should do more of this kind of stuff. Because she's got that powerhouse vocal. And this is that kind of gritty, jazzy, punchy song. But her voice just soars through. See, those are my favorite bits. When she does the those high, 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 high. It looks like I'm spraying myself with perfume. Get yourself some older Nina today. See, I really like that lower breathy vocal rather than a super punchy one. A lot of vocalists would record that in the studio and then be like, nah, I'm gonna cop out live. Not Ariana. And does her voice ever get tired? And she can move into a different style of music effortlessly because of course she started out musical theatre but she's now a pop singer but she could do anything, honestly anything. getting into this. See, I've never seen her live, as in in-person live. And recently I decided I have to, because of performances like this. She's walking around 
doing all this. On stage, just walking around, doing whatever, and she's still hitting those notes. So the video is over. Ariana, banana, banana, anana, anina, banana, anina. So hard. My God. Ariana Grande, one of the best voices of all time. For sure. It's like her voice just floats out her mouth. I mean, those high notes, the chest notes that are super high, the, everything, everything just floats out. And I'd be really interested to see how her voice develops because obviously she's still young and your voice doesn't really hit its peak as a female until your mid thirties. So I'm really excited to see where her voice goes. Yeah, I loved all of those performances. I think she's just a superstar in a tiny, why, why are all the big powerhouse vocals? Why are they all really tiny humans? She is small, she's small. Christina Aguilera is small. Mariah Carey is small. They're all sort of, you know, five foot something. Why, why is that? Why is that? Genuine question. Anyway, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, then please do hit the subscribe button and also let me know what you think about her performances in the comments box below. I'd be very interested to hear and we can have a little chat, a little chit chat. And I'll see you again very soon for another reaction review video.